Hi, I'm Paul from PG Plumbing, and I'm doing a tool talk review on a LED H5R head torch. Um, I've had it for a couple of weeks now, been using it quite a bit. Um, just get it out of the box and show you. It's quite a sturdy um, unit. Strap's really good, quite a lot of flex on there. It's got a battery pack on the back. Um, what I like about it is the fact that it's uh, rechargeable. The charging is done via a magnetic charger. So it's a USB connection on the back. And it just got a little magnetic port there and it charges there. Um, it says it takes about three and a half hours. Um, I've charged it up in about two and a half and it's still going now from a couple of days later. It says you get about two hours of full charge on full beam. Um, you can change the different settings on it so you can have a really bright light, a medium and a, um, a lower light. Um, it's also waterproof to IP65. So if it does get, um, splashed on or anything like that or you're using it outside in the rain it's not going to affect it um, you haven't got to take the battery pack off you can just clip it on there and start um, in the packet it comes with a another silicone strap that um, goes on a helmet and you get helmet clips with that as well so a safety helmet um, other features it's durable it's really strong i've had head torches in the fort pardon me in the past that i felt quite flimsy and you chuck them in your tool bag and they don't really last that long whereas this one feels like it's well built um it is a little bit heavier obviously because you've got quite a bit of a battery pack on the back um but all in all i think it's a really good good head torch um definitely got me out of a spot of bother and a few boilers where my normal magnetic light wasn't quite fit in there and stuff like that so you can angle the head down so you can see that you can twist it right the way through okay it's an easy touch on off so it's not gonna you know you've got to depress it for a second so it's not gonna auto, uh, you know accidentally come on um so i'm just going to take you outside where it's dark and just show you the, how bright it is bear with me a second So it's pitch back out here. That's the brightness of it. You can adjust it to um, fine tune the light or you can have a wide length like that. So it's pretty good. But if you can see all that. Quite a beam on it as well, as you can see. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there you go. Camera's not, there you go. That's quite a, a brightness on it so just like to thank expert trades for sending me this tool to review hope you like it